Hey guys, I'm going to do a video, as you can tell by the title, on a different technique of putting on your eyeshadow. And you probably can't see it because of all my hair, but um, I'm using a sponge. I can't decide whether I want to use this one or this one, but I basically narrowed it down to the small one again. And I'm using the Tardius Pro to Go palette to do it with, which I'm using this color and this color. This one and this one. On the, it's called Hype and Dominate. And again, it's the Tardius Pro to Go Tart Palette. And I'm going to use this little bitty tiny sponge to apply. Hang on, let me to apply my eyeshadow. And I hope you guys can see my eyeshadow because it's, I like it. Oh, ooh, I look like alfalfa. <laughs> I just need a little stem and I'm gonna be alfalfa. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, guys. Uh, let's get started with this technique and I hope you enjoy it. So let's go right now Okay, the last when I tried this I used that's sorry. That's my drawer you here. I used a little sponge and I was gonna try the big sponge, but I Don't think I will because I just don't think the big sponge would work as well as the little because see the little just fits perfectly in there and so I'm gonna continue on with my little sponge and I'm going to do, this is the, do I want this one or do I want the other one? I don't know, guys. I don't know. I'm sorry. She what I got it. Okay. We're going to use, I'm going to use this one. This is the Tardius Pro to Go palette. And uh, I'm going to use the Hype and the Dominate. This is what I'm going to use on my eyes. So, and then I'm going to use this little bitty sponge. If you wonder where I got this sponge, I got this sponge from the Miss A, uh, Miss A website where they have, they have all kinds of makeup, they have everything. And, and a lot of it's just real, I mean, like a dollar, dollar twenty nine. So, you know, you can't go wrong. And what's happening here with my, with myself, I'm just looking miscombobulated. I hope you guys had a good Thanksgiving. We sure did. I didn't vlog any at all. Um, my son, my oldest son was in from Alabama and my granddaughter from Alabama. And I just want to spend some time with them. So I didn't vlog. I didn't do anything. So I'm back. All right, let's try this. Okay, what you do is you dab. You're going to run it like that. Do you see? Okay. And then you're going to go down here on the bottom. And you're going to do the same thing. And then you're going to take that and you're going to, I don't know if I can do this on without looking in my mirror. Didn't quite a little turn out. Now, come on. You guys look so good the other day when I did this. It was so uh, perfect. All right, let's try, the, try it on the other side that and then that like this and then you're gonna go here she kind of just laid it down and then just scooted it just kind of scooted the she definitely didn't do what I just did like what I'm doing but okay let's see let's try that again and you know if it don't work just take your sponge and just go Go do it. Y'all just do it any way you want to because it's not working as well as it did. <gasps> she did it perfect. Of course, she does makeup like no other. I mean, this girl finds different ways to put your makeup on. Different. If you don't know who I'm talking about, I'm going to put it right here because it's Smithka. I think something like that. I'll put it right down below. She's awesome to watch. I'm telling you. She makes everything look so easy. And then when I go to do it, it's like, oh, oh that didn't work. Oh, that didn't work. Okay. There's the colors. And there it is. Yeah. 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 And then the top, I'm just going to go in with my, I could stop right there. I don't have to put anything up there, up, you know, above. But I'm going to, because y'all know how I am. And I'm going to use, of course, my Wet n' Wild Paint Pot. Because why? Because that's my, this is my um, kryptonite. I love this stuff. Love this stuff. 
I use it for underneath my eyeshadow. I use it for eyeshadow. I just use it, y'all. Okay, we're going to go up underneath here. You can go up underneath here, like so. And then we're just going to kind of blend down into that. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. And then we're going to take this other brush and just kind of blend that together. I do like the way it looks with the sponge. It just looks soft, if that makes any sense at all. I just, I don't know, it seems like easier because you just, and you're there, you know, and you're there. Well, I like it. I don't know but y'all. It might not turn out exactly how she did it, but does it have to be exact? I'm asking you, does it have to be exact? And then the first time I did it, I just put it there and there and just kind of laid it down, rubbed, and it was perfect. But it could be the colors, too. You know, the, the different colors that you use. I was using from the Maybelline Lemonade Craze palette when I first did it. I was using this color and this color. These two colors here and here. Here. Here and here. And it just laid down so pretty. This is an awesome palette. You don't want to give a gift. You need to find the Lemonade Craze palette to your teenagers or whoever loves um, orange, that likes the orange and stuff, because that's a good palette. That's a good. This is a pretty good palette, too. Tardiest Pro to Go. I've had this a while, but there's the colors. And it smells like cocoa. I kid you not. I ain't lying. Okay, then I'm going to go ahead and take the pointy part of this little bitty sponge, and I'm going to go in underneath here like so, like that, and like that, yeah, uh-huh, right in there, and right in there, there we go, and we're done, that was so easy too. In like how many um what did I just drop I thought I dropped something in my chair. Um and like how many uh brushes did I use for this look? I'm asking you. You know what I'm saying? It's like that was easy. That was easy. Okay, what do y'all think about that? Uh that technique. You can use a big one. Like I said, she used a big one. It didn't have a little thing here, it just went straight down. But, and this one would probably work, but to me, I don't know. It might have, it would have gone up bigger because hers came up here as it would this one. But the little one is just easier. It's just easier to handle. You know what I'm saying? Do you know? Do you know what I'm saying? So anyway, I'm miscombobulated a lot here. <laughs> All right, now we're going to do the eyes and I'm not wearing eyeshadow. So, I mean, <laughs> I'm not going to wear my eyelashes but i am going to fix my eyes so i'm going to do this side let you watch me put my eyeshadow on this side and then i'm going to stop the camera and do the other eye because it takes me so stinking long you know what i'm saying could i just shut saying that up for once yeah okay hold that thought okay okay guys i have been working on my eye technique okay and so, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do this eye, kind of show you, and then I'll go back into the other eye. I haven't been using my lighter, you know, cause since my hair's falling out, I just figured don't burn, don't burn what hair you have left. <laughs> you know, so anyway, I'm going to show you what I did, and it really did. It worked, and it stayed all day. So, I used my um, eyelash curler, and I kind of left it on there for just a little bit. I'm going to give you all a close-up of how that turned out with the sponge turned out pretty good and then i did it again y'all i'm looking for a sherpa belt bag not a belt bag well yeah belt bag slash crossbody i've been looking online and i found i want the mz wallace crossbody belt bag but I don't want it just yet until I figure out if I'm really going to like the crossbody. You know, the the belt bag. There we go. See that? Do you see that? So I've been looking online. And I think it's 
some good ones. All right, let's do this. I'm using the um, Sensational Sky High. And here's how I did it. Okay, I started at the base and I went up. I'm not really worried about the top right now, just the base. Get the base going. I'm going to try not to get it all over me like I did the last time. My lashes look good, but I got the stupid mascara all over me. And of course, I know, you know, how to wipe it off with the Q-tip. But that's not the point, because when you wipe it off the Q-tip, then you wipe your makeup off, too. Then you have to go back and do your makeup. And if you're done it with a sponge, that's not going to be easy. Did you get all that? So, here's how I did it. I just kept going up and up and up, pushing up. Tried to do it like the professionals, okay? Trying to be a professional here. Now, I know a lot of you don't like Get Ready With Me, Me's or whatever you want to call it. But a lot of you do. So I have to do get ready with me to satisfy the other side of my subs that do like this. And I was anxious to show you guys too about the sponge. You see? Don't that don't that look good? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then I'm gonna go back and do the other eye, and then I'm gonna come back and do this eye again. Actually, let me just put one more coat on while I'm here. Let me just put a coat on. Okay. Y'all, I ate so much Thanksgiving weekend, it's not even funny. We ate, then we had my son from Alabama said, oh, leftovers. Well, he got it. We all got it. And we're all suffering from it. Or I am anyway. But, you know, you just, yeah. And did I get my dressing sandwich? No. Dressing went bye-bye, and I didn't even get a dressing sandwich. That's okay. I can always buy a box of dressing and go make my own. Okay. Do you see that? Looks pretty good. I mean, y'all probably think that's this is nothing because y'all have curled up eyelashes. But those of you who have been following me know my eyelashes don't curl up. Okay? They, they just don't. Alright. I'm going to take the camera off. I'm going to do the same thing to this side and then I'll be back. Do y'all ever have a, a one one eye that just don't want to cooperate? Well, mine's the left one. It's this one. This one just, you just gotta, uh, I don't know. You gotta work with it, work with it, and work with it, and work with it. And it does this all the time. All the time. It's like, I, if you don't cooperate, I'm gonna beat you. I'm gonna get the hose. Don't make me get the hose. Ooh, I made a mess there. I try to keep the tops of these clean, my mascaras. Now, let me tell y'all something about this Sky High Mascara. I used it, and I kind of liked it, but I wasn't real impressed. I mean, it didn't do anything that the others don't do. I mean, I didn't think. But then the more I use it, the more I kind of like it. But I will say, and I'm out of it, the telescopic uh, mascara, yeah, I like it better than this one, I think. I'm out of it, but as far as separating your eyelashes. But this one don't do bad. I mean, see? It don't do bad at all. If I can just get this one to go up, you know? Without getting it all over the top of my eye. That's what drives me crazy. It's getting it on top of my eye. It's like, oh. Alright, guys, let me get the bottom here. Just let me, if you will, excuse me a moment, and let's just get the bottom. Because I like the bottom to look as long and pretty, purdy. Just long and purdy like the top. You know what I mean? You know what I mean, Vern. Anyway, um, I hope you guys did have a lovely, lovely Thanksgiving. And we're blessed with lots of food, lots of family, lots of good visiting time and you know all that fun stuff now my oldest son two well all my sons spent most of their the from thursday on playing golf with my husband because they're golfers as well but we did spend time together at thanksgiving so yeah here we go all right what you think 
Okay, see, that's just as long. That one I'm not happy with. Hold that thought again. Okay, guys, there's that. Um, I'm going to close my eyes so y'all can see. Y'all tell me what you think. I just think that sponge makes it prettier. I don't know why. I don't know. I'm not sure the difference, What? why that technique makes such a big difference. But I like it. I'm going to have to buy me some more of those itty bitty teeny weeny sponges. And that's it. Um, I just wanted to do that with you and show you that technique. And again, I used a little bitty tiny sponge. And you can wipe this off. You can wash it, clean it up for the next round. I just, yeah. Anyway, I think I have another one in there too. <laughs> I bought a package from Miss A. I, I, I speak of Miss A all the, a lot. And y'all don't know who I'm talking about. Oh, this one's different. This has got the little indentions. I don't want this one. See, it's got the, I won't use that for this technique. But... They came in different sizes and stuff. I'll I'll try to, if I can remember, to leave the link below for Miss A. Anyway, guys, that's it. Okay, guys, um, yeah, my hair's still falling out, and it's just very thin, you know. But I'm just dealing with it the best I can, you know. See that bald spot right there? Do you guys see that bald spot? Yeah, I tried to get hair and put hair on top of it. I need to ask, uh, what was her name? Uh, Lori. Lori and Poodoo, do you ever watch her? Um, Lori and Poodoo dog or Lori and Poodoo. I need to ask her. She's got some stuff she dabbed on her scalp that's the same color as her hair. And it helps cover up that bald spot. I need to get a hold of her. Lori, if you're watching my video, tell me where you get that at. Because I've been eating some. <laughs> okay, guys. That's it. I hope you enjoyed this video. Give me a thumbs up. Click the channel. Um, click the channel. Click the bell, and you'll be notified every time I put up a video, and I hope you enjoyed this video on um, the application, a different, uh, just a new way of applying eyeshadow, and y'all go watch uh, Smithka. I put it on the screen, and uh, yeah, go watch her, because she it is phenomenal how she puts makeup on. I mean, there's two different kinds of techniques I've tried with that she's done, and of course they didn't turn out like hers. <laughs> of course not. But go watch her. And go watch Laurie and Pooh do, because they're just cute as bugs ears. Anyway, guys, um, share my channel if you know anybody that would enjoy it, and I'll catch you guys on the flip. Bye.